Scattering objects is now much easier in Blender 5.0. Here let's create a quick forest on this subdivided plane. For this I have a collection with trees. Select the ground and add the scatter on surface modifier. Under instancing we can either pick an individual object or the entire collection. To only show the individual objects of the collection check pick instance. Let's switch the distribution method to Poisson disk which allows us to set a minimum distance between the instances. We can randomize the scatter by changing the seed value. Now under transform we can disable a line rotation so the trees won't follow the curvature of the surface and rather grow straight up. Next we can define the general scale and when randomize is checked we can randomize the transform. For example the Z rotation or the scale. We can also increase the flip value to flip a certain portion of the trees along a certain axis. Now if you don't like that the trees are growing everywhere all values that show this icon here we can replace with a vertex group. First let's create a new vertex group in the object data tab. Back in the modifier settings let's click this icon behind density and pick the vertex group as input. Now all trees disappear since we now have to paint the vertex group in weight paint mode. Now you can paint where the trees should be with left click and erase with control left click. And this easy you can scatter objects in Blender 5.0. By the way if you like to create fun low poly worlds in Blender check out my cubic worlds course over at cgboost.com courses.